You're lying. I, I swear to you, I'm not lying. I'm not, well, I'm, okay, I'm lying a little bit, but I'm a producer, and that's what I do. And I will have your money in full, I promise you. You got 72 hours. After that, I choke you to death. Come on, I'm not an idiot. You haven't painted the most accurate portrait of our investor. All right! We've been in trouble before. We always find a way out. It's all over the street. You need money. Why don't you guys come by the set? Frank Pierce is going to be there. Excuse me, Mr. Pierce. I'm so sorry to bother you. Can I get your autograph? Frank Pierce was insured for $5 million. This scumbag, he doesn't shoot a frame of film and he makes $5 million. Well, how would you have felt if all you had to show for it was a lousy insurance check? Look, I got a scam. What do you mean a scam? We make it look like we're actually going to be putting together a movie. We heavily insure the star who'll do his own stunts. You're Duke Montana? Yeah, that's Duke Montana. What are you doing, Duke Montana? Come on, Daily Game. I'm rushing through that. You are perfect for this particular part. I really connected to the story. Uh-huh. Yeah, but Duke is like a Western, you know? It's very masculine. Oh. Congratulations. Kill him in a stunt, he's dead. And then we're rich. We're rich. Action! Duke Montana, if he were alive right now, I know he would be saying, Where's that damn horse at? Duke, my, my God, you're alive. You don't know this guy. He's got like nine lives. It's not that hard to kill somebody. We're shooting this fantastic rope scene. It's going to be a real killer. If it wasn't for you, I'd be six foot under up on Boot Hill right now. Uh-huh. I'm going to hunt you down. These people are ready to die for you. Not the best choice of words. We in the business. What kind of a human being are you? Well, I'm a producer. How is it a guy making a million dollar movie don't have a better car? I don't believe in ostentatious flamboyance. What are you, stupid? No! Here's the thing, I like you. I know your diagnosis complicates things, but I don't care. Hey, man. Do you like me? Yes, I do. Even but... though I don't have cancer? <laughs> Make your move, Romeo! <laughs> Most teenagers feel like they're invincible. Not the Superman kind of invincible. The kind of invincible that tricks you into thinking tomorrow might be a better day to start chasing your dreams. I'm gonna throw up. We've been through this, just breathe. You are my best friend, so you are morally obligated to say nice things to me. Everybody else out there is not my best friend. If everyone else doesn't like it, then they're idiots. And while there's a lot that I don't know at my age, what I do know is this. We all have limited time. Tell me something you never told before Before I walk through the door I adore you, I adore you I do How are you? I'm off chemo Is it because it worked or what? Or I do What you're facing is scary But you get to decide what matters most now Never give up Shut the front door, are you writing a song? Hello I was thinking it might be cool if we did something that was just ours. Fix me up, my darling. Zach, have you looked on YouTube? You have 20,000 views? You should be happy. I thought this is what you wanted. It doesn't really matter what I want because it's not going to happen. It's not fair. Please stop. I have nothing to give you. No ring, Zach. no future, nothing. Zach! You got so much in there that the world needs to hear. What are you going to do with it? This is insane. Just breathe. We'll go up, 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 but I'll fly a little higher in home. Are you him? No. Up, up, up. Yeah, I'm Zach. It's my favorite song. In the end, I just want to make people happy. I, Zachary Sobiak, am asking you. Yes! Please yes. go to For as long as I can. <laughs> Because what some people take for granted, others are fighting for. And believe me, I'm a fighter.
Happy Thanksgiving. This time of year is always really hard for me because I hate my family. Hey. How hot is my wife? Mm. Lower the chocolates. They can see your breasts, oh. baby. Hey. Hey. Just wanted to let you know God, that... Is this moisturizer just for the face? Or is... Oh, hey. Ah. This is Jeff. Sorry. No big deal. I have one just like it in my top drawer. Except mine's bigger. Regret. That's the whole point of Thanksgiving, Molly. Sugar and regret. My turkey. <laughs> spiral out of control due to the oxygen crisis that the world has termed the sickness. Last year, I had 20 kids in my class. This year, I have 12. Ethan White, do you know what your father did here? Meet the Chronicle. What if I told you that you could save all of us? Save your wife. We received a message from the future. The future? This is a time machine? The people who sent the message must have found a cure. Do you really believe I'm going to save the world? You're all men, Louisa. You may be humanity's only chance to find their cure. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Are you there? Whoever sent the message, we need to find it. We are at the beginning of the journey that can change everything. You have to trust me now. This isn't about finding a cure anymore. There's something bigger at play. Imagine that we are all connected by the very fabric of the universe. An invisible field that bonds us together. You, me, the stars. We can't change anything. It's always going to play out this way. There is no other way! We are all connected through time. This ain't about saving the world. Oh, you must be the birthday girl. I got big plans. Well, so have I. Oh, yeah? Uh, I'm gonna make a million dollars by the time I'm 30. Well, I'm gonna make two million. But uh, good for you, keep it modest. <laughs> You're from Australia, right? What are you doing in New York? If you wanna make it as a singer, America is where you need to be. <laughs> I'm being paid less than the band. So they're men, they got families to feed. Well, I've got a family to feed. Tells me I have to choose between career and marriage. I tell her we can have both. <laughs> From now on, no one will tell us what we can and can't do. Miss Reddy, you sing, you sing very nicely, but male groups all the rage right now. You've heard of the Beatles, right? Did it ever occur to you men to, to ask women what they want to listen to? <laughs> Ellen, she's tapped into something here. Remember that march in New York and how many women showed up to that? Bunch of record sales marching down the street. I am woman, hear me roar. In numbers too big to ignore. It's and kind of angry. It's man-hating. Jeff, you okay with this? What are you doing? You want to lose your recording contract? This is more than just a song to me. Thank God, because she makes everything possible. Strong, strong. I am invisible, invisible. put all the pieces in place. This is the best house on the market. Trust me. It just seems too good to be true. 
What would happen in a horror movie now? <laughs> Everyone I care about ends up dead. As if it wasn't bad enough that we're babysitting on Halloween. That's what they were doing back there. Test. The engine will not start in 1718. It's the devil's lake impaler. It's not over. He can still come back. I'm pretty sure something bad happened here. You don't understand! <laughs> you have to kill me! Now! You okay? Picking up hitchhikers is dangerous business. It's how horror movies start. It's like you're having a rough night. It's 11 a.m. Hi, I'm hunting a creature. Well, a man. Maybe you've seen him? How are we gonna fix this? I'd like to rent a wood chipper. We are in a horror movie! Nobody? Horror. Horror movie. Final girl, huh? It's cool. Most people live life between the moments, never truly seeing what's right in front of them until the moment is gone. Do you remember the first time we met? Our whole lives, everything, everything has led up to this. Ladies and gentlemen, the world's first temporal manipulation portal. So tell me, you don't think there's any risk of ripping a permanent hole in space-time with this thing? Oh my god. Warning. Safety protocols disengaged. Baby, get out of there! I've seen what those things can do. You have to fight them, Ryan! You, you have to resist! Warning. Warning. Accelerator activation sequence initiating. In three, two, one. I never fit in, never could win. This isn't the life you wanted. Though I tried and tried, it'll be better for you. This feeling don't end. I promise. Swear I fell in love with country music when I was a little girl. When are you gonna let me hear you play? Run home. If you're too scared to perform them songs. I'll run Ain't gonna do no good. With nowhere to go. I received another letter. Immigration and customs enforcement! We have a warrant to search! Does anyone else here reside with you? Is there anyone who lives here? No. No one resides with you? No. No other residents? Ah! Hey! Ah! Hey! my first night there, I see this guy, and I was terrified. You're dead. <laughs> Believe me, choosing to live your life loud and proud is about the bravest thing you can do in this world. That robot's pretty good. He's getting <laughs> I'm Tiffany, your new neighbor. I'm Aaron. <laughs> this is my partner. Hi. Wow. I'm just so happy we have some fresh faces in the neighborhood. Love is all that matters. I'm not sure most people would actually agree with that. I find it disgusting how false stereotypes shape public opinion. Aaron, last night,
I think I saw something. There's something not right about this place. What are you talking about? There was a couple that were killed 10 years ago. They knew, and they didn't say anything. You need to stop thinking that everyone's trying to get you all the time. Marshall and Tiffany are good people. Well, to new neighbors. New neighbors. We've been chosen. Chosen for what? Some kind of ritual. Every 10 years, they make a selection. Do you see that? We're the selection.